there is no such thing as bad cholesterol. It's not, it doesn't exist. It's not the LDL. It's not the ratio between the LDL and the HDL cholesterol. These are the molecules that pick the cholesterol up and transport them around the body. All they are are the taxi drivers. They're the ones carrying it around, but they're being directed. They're being directed what to do, basically because your body is out of balance or not. And so the real measure here is the level of inflammation. You see, the difference between the HDL and LDL is indicating some metabolic issues. Yep, maybe, maybe. And those metabolic issues link back to a metabolic imbalance, and that links back to inflammation. So your doctor can check for CRP, C-reactive protein. Now, this is a real risk factor. This is what you really want to lower, and you lower that through good nutrition and anti-inflammatory nutrients and all those things, diet, lifestyle, getting out in the sun like I am now. That is the real indicator. Now, the second indicator for cardiovascular disease is your calcium score. And basically, that's calcification of your arteries. And that's really, really easy to measure. Your doctors can get it organized and you can have those two results and that'll tell you the cholesterol is just the fire alarm telling you what to do. C-reactive protein and your calcium score indicating if there's calcium on the inside of your arteries, that's when it's formed crystals, then you've got a problem and that's when you can take steps through new good nutrition and lifestyle to lower the calcification and lower your C-reactive protein.